Thyroid is a gland which is located in front of the neck and wrapped around the trachea or windpipe below the Adam's apple. Normally, you cannot feel the thyroid in its normal size. This gland produces and releases hormones that help control many functions of the body. If our body produces too much thyroid hormones, it can develop a condition called hyperthyroidism. And if the body makes too little amount of thyroid hormones, it's called hypothyroidism. Hypothyroidism affects about 5% of the population and can manifest a variety of symptoms. Thus, knowing enough about this condition might help you prevent or treat it if you are suffer from it. A number of factors can result into hypothyroidism. The most common cause is autoimmune disorders, means when your body attacks the thyroid and affects the thyroid ability to produce hormones. The exact mechanism of autoimmune disorders is unknown, but genes and environmental triggers play a significant role. Another cause of hypothyroidism is thyroid surgery. Removing a large portion or all of the thyroid gland can diminish or stop hormones production. In this case, you must take thyroid hormone supplements. Radiation therapy that used to treat cancers, especially neck and head cancer, where the radioactive rays directly hit the thyroid gland can lead to hypothyroidism. Damage to the pituitary gland is also one of the causes of hypothyroidism. The pituitary is a gland that controls the thyroid hormone secretion of thyroid gland. When the pituitary gland is damaged, it may not be able to control thyroid gland anymore and the thyroid may stop secreting hormones. A number of medicines such as lithium, amiodarone, and interleukin-2 can prevent a thyroid gland to produce enough amount of thyroid hormones. These medicines should be taken under the supervision of the doctor. Too little iodine on the diet is one of the common causes of the hypothyroidism worldwide. The thyroid needs iron to produce its hormones. Iron is not produced by our body, so we need to get it through the diet. Iron found primarily in seafood and vegetable grown in iodine-rich soil. Other sources are egg, dairy products, and seaweed. Iron deficiency is common in some parts of the world, but addition of the iron supplement to table salt can eliminate the problem. Anyone can develop hypothyroidism, but you are at the higher risk in the following situations. If you are a woman, if you are older than 60 years, family history of hypothyroidism, pregnancy or deliver the baby within the past 6 months, having autoimmune disorders such as type 1 diabetes, treating with antithyroid medications and previous thyroid surgery. The signs and symptoms of hypothyroidism often start at a later stage of hypothyroidism and vary depending on the severity of hormone deficiency. The symptoms of hypothyroidism are often mimic other medical conditions. This can make it difficult to know if your symptoms are related to thyroid disorder or other medical issues. The symptoms may include constipation, dry hair and hair loss, dry skin, feeling of fatigue, Changes in menstrual cycles, depression, sensitivity to cold, elevated cholesterol, muscle weakness, obesity, puffy face, and sometimes a swelling of the thyroid gland. If you have symptoms related to hypothyroidism, your doctor may order a blood test to make a definite diagnosis. The test called thyroid function test looks at level of thyroxine or T4 and thyroid stimulating hormone or TSH in the blood. There are some less common tests may be recommended in special conditions like evaluating autoimmune disorders. What is the treatment? Hypothyroidism is usually treated by replacing the hormone that is no longer produced by the thyroid. Your doctor will prescribe a synthetic thyroid hormone for you in this case. The most common form is levothyroxine. There are a lot of medications that can interfere with the absorption of thyroid supplements. So make sure to let your doctor know about all your medications. Hypothyroidism is a manageable condition. You need to take medication to normalize the level of thyroid hormones in your body for the rest of your life. But what happens if hypothyroidism is not treated? It can become a serious and life-threatening condition if it stays uncontrolled. The symptoms become more severe that include heart problems because the level of LDL and cholesterol can rise and develop heart and vessel problems. Goiter 
If the thyroid gland tries to produce more hormone, it can swell and lead to some complications, like difficult swallowing, and you also can feel the enlarged gland in front of the neck. Mental problems. Low thyroid hormone level can affect memory and decrease concentration as well as decrease interest in activities you used to enjoy before. Visit your doctor as you notice these symptoms. There are some other complications that might happen like infertility, joint pain, obesity, and peripheral neuropathy. When you start taking thyroid hormone supplements, or your doctor decides to change the dosage of your medication, you need to have your TSH check 6 to 10 weeks later. Once you have settled into a certain medicine dosage, you can take TSH tests about once a year.